This morning, our senators from Florida are in Broward County visiting with the Parkland community following Wednesday's deadly mass shooting at that high school. 17 people killed, a dozen more injured. And News Channel 8's Evan Donovan is there live this morning with what Florida lawmakers are saying in the wake of this tragedy. Evan. Yes, yeah, Stacey, Senator Bill Nelson addressing the media here just a few blocks away, in fact, a few hundred feet away from the high school where this terrible shooting took place just a few days ago. And Senator Nelson saying that it has got to be a change in the law, that that is the only way that we will prevent these mass shootings from happening in the future. Senator Nelson described himself as a Second Amendment supporter. He says he is a gun owner and he does hunt, including now with his son, and says he's hunted all his life. But he really decried the use of assault rifles and the easy accessibility to them, saying that assault rifles are not for hunting, they are for killing. He also blamed how certain measures were caught up in the Senate due to the powerful gun lobby and the power that they wield over some of the legislators that he works with. That is a big part of the problem, according to Senator Nelson. And he talked about how this could be different, how this could be the moment because of the way that the victims, families have spoken out, the parents of some of these high schoolers and some of the high schoolers themselves saying that this could be the moment for change. Maybe this will be the turning point. Maybe the students speaking out so boldly as they have on national TV, maybe the parents crying out and speaking so boldly as they have that maybe this will be the turning point because, in fact, enough is enough. As you have heard in the sound bites that we've played for you from countless numbers of students and parents, they are calling for change, saying that there's little they can do. The students themselves feel helpless. And Senator Nelson spoke directly to that, saying that it is his and his fellow senators' responsibility and other legislators to do something about this. He also talked about how he'd like to change President Trump's view on assault rifles. He mentioned how bump stock legislation couldn't even get through the Congress even after the Las Vegas shooting in which so many people were killed as a result of an assault rifle that basically turned into a machine gun. Senator Nelson called on the Florida legislature as well, talking about legislators right here in the state saying that they could do some things to change the law here and make things better for Floridians. Stacey, back to you. Well, Evan, with so much call for change, I think if there's ever been momentum, it's probably now. So thank you very much for your live coverage down there.